So what it? It's your boy McFly, man, the hardest working man in shoe tainment today. And welcome back to the landing strip, man. If this is your first time over here in the landing, McFly, man, I welcome you. I appreciate you stopping by. Be sure to hit that subscribe button and that notification bell down below, man, to keep you up to date with everything that I got going on. And it's always something going on. You can check my upload list, bro. It, it stay popping like late nights on bad streets man it, <laughs> it's going down man we're currently on the road to 5k man so if everybody sub up we can go ahead and get that done almost at 3,000 man i think we should hit 3,000 next month hopefully if, if all goes well but we'll see how it goes bro like i said the mission is five so get it to five who has the heat season seven will be rolling around real soon so be prepared for that be sure to subscribe to the who has the heat youtube channel and the who has the heat ig page all the links will be down in the description below everything that i mentioned will be in the description below there's some very vital information in the description below all you got to do is get in the description below the show comprises of me myself e-money shoes pm kicks and 313 retro queen we are the militia the coalition holding it down for your sneaker battle needs bro it's what we do um but as you can see we here we in the cockpit or whatever <laughs> you want to call it bro we got another show to, another shoe to show another review for you guys and um it's gonna be the converse run star motion boom in the black colorway like the og type of feel on that joint so fasten your lap belts man and let's prepare to take flight All right, man, we got you locked and loaded on this close-up action for all my real verse fakers. Just giving you a shot of that size tag on these run star motions that I'm not really sure that you can run in. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I don't know if people faking these. I don't know what the demand is like, but you know, any shoe that comes into this airport, we gonna review it, bro. Cause that's what I do. That's why I have the most diverse channel on YouTube because there's no telling what you gonna see over here. So, box, bam, black, converse, bam. Converse, bam. The back is blank. And you got your white tissue paper in there. And that's pretty much all she wrote on your box. Now the shoe. Now this one looks a bit better to me simply because it's got the, the OG Chuck Taylor vibes. You know, the black Chuck Taylor that used to be a staple in my shoe collection. It's not anymore, but at one point in life, it was. So on this joint, you got the all black uh, canvas material upper with the tan lining on the inside. You got that tan lining in there. Oh, they kept the bright hits on that joint. I didn't know that. I thought that would have been black too. Got that in there. Uh, you got white stitching. As you can see, solid hit. Wrapping around to that medial side, you got your Converse star. This is like leather on this joint. The other one was like suede. So this is like leather on here. Got your star in the middle. Still black on this medial side. Uh, flat white laces came in the shoe. On your tongue, you have Chuck Taylor in uh, black. Uh, you can't really see it because it's black on black, but it's definitely on there. It's kind of like an emblem, if you will. It's like you can kind of feel it, it's textured and all that. So love the back of the shoe because you got that star hit right there boom big old star and this big thick massive chunky alien face stomper sole uh i noticed that on a lot of these they do the heel one color and the forefoot another color i think they should do them both like if this if this was black instead of gum or two gums instead of black i think it still would have been a decent looking shoe you didn't really have to um switch them up like that but that's just my opinion you know it is what it is i'm entitled to it that's why you're here you came here to hear what i think right or you came to see the shoe either way you're here so double whammy take them both um you still have your uh glossy toe cap on these these have been worn so it may be a little dirt on them you know but if you don't wear a shoe you can't give a real review about it right i mean come on man you gotta put it on your feet people out here buying shoes just leave them in a drop front for a decade never mind that's a whole Another rant for a whole nother store. Or buying shoes just to flip them and set you know, Calm down. Okay, all white mid so You see it going? Then you got your gum hit on the forefoot. You got your black hit on the back. White in the middle. And that's how it's rocking. Um, 
I'm not mistaken, Camera Lady gave Comfort on these a, a B or a B plus on these joints. This shoe is kind of heavy, man. For me, for me, honest, it's it's got some weight to it. But when you are in the field stomping alien faces, man, you gotta have it. So same matches. The right shoe matches the left shoe to the T. Nothing differentiating there. Star on the back. Converse patch here. All that. They should do like a leather pair of these. They would be dope. Maybe they have. I don't know. Like I said, it's my first time really seeing the shoe today. So, But soft, thick, chunky midsole on these joints. If you want the inches on your height, this will definitely give it to you. So don't stray away. If you short, get these. You'll be taller. That's all I'm saying. Solid pair of kicks, man. Uh, how you guys feeling about them? Let me know in the comments below. Fit, you definitely need to go up like a half size in these joints, unless you one of them narrow foot people because it's still a Chuck Taylor, so it fit like a Chuck Taylor because it's a Chuck Taylor, you know what I'm saying? So whatever shoe, whatever size you will buy in a regular Chuck Taylor shoe, do that. If you have a narrow foot, you could probably stay true to size, but if you have a regular foot or a wide foot, you probably need to size up. So here's what it is, man. Solid shoe. I like the way this one looks better than the other pair, but they both decent pair of kicks, man. But uh, I'd rather know what you guys think. Until next time, it's your boy McFly. These Converse Run Star Motions. I'll holler at you.